Useless waste of time. Can't argue with that. Here's Bo and Peter with wrestling news. Give it! Go! Oh, hell with it! Wrestling news, episode 52. Toilet times. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another thrilling episode of Comic Book Man's Video Outhouse. I am your host, of course, humble Uncle Peter, and joining me as he always does, the Oracle himself, Bo. Bo, ever so classy. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And today we're bringing you news from the WWE, although it should be retitled Exodus for reasons we'll get into uh, in a minute. But we're doing this where we always do it from Alternate Reality Incorporated, that comic book megastore next to the corner of 111th and Kenzie in the scenic, bucolic, whatever else, ick, Rustic. Chicago neighborhood of Mount Greenwood here in Chicago, as I said. Peptic. Alternate Reality Incorporated, where all your new books, Septic. 15% off. He gives it to you just for coming in. So, so take come, it. So take it. Do be there. Anyway, like I said, uh, we're doing Exodus here. I mean, news from the WWE. Why do you, you're asking right now, I can hear you. Why are you calling it Exodus, Uncle Peter? Because it seems like everybody's leaving. Starting with. There's something weird going on with Matt Hart. Weird. Uh, What's weird about him? He got sent home from a house show in New York City a couple weeks ago. Right. Actually, he was told that he was in no condition to perform, and he sort of walked away, and he never came back for the show. Why would they say he's in no condition? They though? wouldn't say exactly what condition he was in. He you just know, wasn't little, in a condition to perform. A little intoxicated? They're, a little, not really uh, sure. They're not really sure. They okay. Say. They won't say. So they it's a, miss, it's they a puzzle. They went on a tour, to, tour of England, and on the last day, they told Matt that he would not be used again. Right. Now, the story broke that he was sent home, but he wasn't sent home. He was still in the hotel that the rest of us were staying at. He wasn't allowed to work. <sighs> now... That would have been fine, except for the day after the story broke, Matt started posting a lot Put of up his own version of events. videos, yes. one of which showed him in his hotel room in England, watching, of all things, a pro wrestling website, which the WWE kind of doesn't really like. For you yeah, they, they like to think they're the only ones, and they frown on publicizing anybody else. And since that point, he's posted a couple more videos. In fact, the last video has him in a gym that's empty, wrestling, talking about, asking fans to vote whether this is a work or not, while he says his a favorite work. fruit in the they world do that. is grapes. Now, it's this has gone on for about a week. Right. If it was real, you would assume Matt would have been fired. But he Maybe. Hasn't. So now people are starting to wonder whether this is an angle to make him a little more important or whether he's trying to actively get himself fired. So he could go to TNA. Because if he gets fired, he can leave, and he doesn't have to wait 90 days. Okay. But if he's let, but if not, then he just simply go, we've agreed to let you go. He has to sit around for basically So, so why would he weeks. want to go to TNA? His brother's there. Ah. In fact, one of the videos posted this week, it's Jeff Hardy in it. So hey. I don't know. But I, this is this is starting to drift into the concept of a work. Of a work. Just trying to attract a little attention. Now, for the unintentional Something work. A work yeah. is basically something that is set up as real, which isn't real. It's which isn't BS. real. It's just meant to draw your attention, your interest, and your money for right. whatever they come it's up with in the future. Clancy. It's a contrivance, yes. A contrivance. Thank you, Camera Boy, for Thank that you. for that contribution. Camera Boy, he's pretty uh, somebody he's else. Well, that's, we're going to leave Matt Hardy in the dust Real. right now. We're going to move on to somebody else. And that would be the Lionheart, as he was known back yes. in the day. Go. King Richard? That's Chris your, Jericho. Chris Jericho. Chris okay. Jericho. Chris Jericho, now this is kind of weird. Chris Jericho's contract with the WWE effectively ends at the end of September. Right. On Tuesday the 28th, the three-disc WWE Chris Jericho uh, compilation comes out. Who? Coincidence? A month, a month from wonder. now, you've got the Chris Jericho second book, which is supposedly is probably as good as the first book. Uh, more than likely, he is going to re-sign with the WWE. They've already got a match tentatively set up with him for WrestleMania for next year, but he's probably going to take about three or four months off. Now, to set this up, if you watched Raw, which has been, which which happened a couple of days ago, yeah, they yeah. did two shows in a row. On the second show that'll be on uh, the week before the WWE, the, the the DVD comes out on the 28th. At the end of the show, Randy Orton's going to kick him in the head and take him out for a couple months. So Hunt. we would assume he's going to go away for a while and then come back and yes. work lesser days. Because he's going to publish publicize his book and, and his, his, you know, his rock band is he's rock band a CD coming out. He's going to do some touring. And stuff. Sure thing. Well, uh, I sense another work in progress. I, and a third work, but apparently 
a real life exit would be the Amazon. Oh, I love this woman. This broke this story broke this I man's heart, it. boys and girls. I love Remember it. we told you about the six foot nine Aloysia who was nine. To be part of NXT season three? Yes. Her real name Lindsay Howard Hayward. Lindsay she was Hayward. actually cut from the WWE this yes, week because her. her pictures <laughs> yes, her pic when I've seen her pictures. They were linked to an escort service. And she says what? she says she did not work for an escort service. She did the pictures. The guy who sold the pictures let them go. They're on there. She never did any escort work at all. And the pictures, if you see them, were pictures of her with brown hair, wearing a bustier, and you know. And, before and, she had some work before, done. Before she had her boobs done and everything yeah, else. Yeah, She done. said she did not do anything for an escort service. And I believe her. She just the did those woman pictures. Is six foot nine. Yeah, I huge. got. I can't tell you how much I love I a woman who could hurt me. I got the pictures. I'll send you. Oh, she this is the man. This is the man. Finally, the, uh, the, the only real one we've got coming right here. Uh, Christian, medical issues. Christian had, uh, Christian had a torn pectoral muscle. He had surgery this week. He'll be out for about six months. Yes. Uh, he, he did have a program started with Alberto Del Rio. That program basically got cut. Uh, the apparent, second obviously. part of the SmackDown taping, which will be on, uh, actually was on like last night if you look at this one. So, Christian's no longer with the W. He's gonna be well, he's for, on the shelf. He's going to be gone for six months, which yes. could be another reason why they're not going to cut Matt Hardy, because you now have a hole in your roster. Now you got now you got a so stories to why fill. why cut a guy exactly. who can work a program Yes, because he wants to leave? Exactly. So, Christian, uh, heal up. We wish you the best. Just like we wish all our faithful viewers the best. Uh, thanks for stopping oh, oh, by. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You, you didn't see SmackDown last night, did you? I did not. Guess who came back? Who? Paul Bearer's back, boys and girls. Lumpy! Lumpy has Lumpy returned. Lumpy's back! It's on YouTube. Look at us. Hook yes! up the link and you can see it. It's amazing. Welcome back, Lumpy. You were not missed. He's even got the urn. Cool. And that's going to wrap it up for us. He sprung that one on me on the last minute. Hence my delight. Uh, for all of this, for all the late-breaking news that this man finds for you uh, in comic books, movies, media, this stuff, everything he works so hard to bring you, go, you go to our little stop on the Information Superhighway. Where is it? It's Where is all it? there. Where is it? This little sprite Who? we keep around. Sarah, Who? she's going to tell him. Her? Yeah, her. www.myalternatereality.com it changes almost every day, unlike on the bookman and his socks. So now you know where to go. I know now. So go there, check it out. Give this man's life meaning he works so very hard for you. In the meantime, this has been Uncle Peter. And Bo. Wishing you see ya. The alternate reality hero of the month this month is Wolverine. That's right. The man who's the best he is at what he does is going to be 25% off all month long here at Alternate Reality. All of his soft covers, all of his hard covers, all of his essentials. Every Wolverine trade paperback in the place is 25% off all month long. And uh, our Hero of the Week sale, which is every week, will feature Wolverine all month long. So there'll be a bunch of Wolverine comic books that'll be a buck each all month long here at Alternate Reality. So like Wolverine, we're the best we are at what we do, and that save you money. The Video Outhouse is brought to you by some of the finest people willing to work for free. This is a list of some of them.